look nice hat first of all I don't know if it's a Christmas present or what but if you if you cast your mind back to last Christmas and the situation you were then 12 months on just just tell us what the last 12 months have been like for you um really positive uh obviously getting my first spell in um professional football in the football league I feel like I've had a, a good solid 12 months um obviously coming last season um it was a bit of a struggle we needed team was was Probably down the bottom half of the table, but um, look, we got the points we needed to stay up. And then this season, I think it's been quite steady. We've had some good results and some bad results, but um, I'd say at halfway point this season, I think it's been pretty steady. How much better do you feel you are as a player now? Yeah, I've, well, I feel like I've improved massively from last season. I'd like to think that I'm, I'm trying to improve every game, but um, everyone knows that I'm, we're going to have off games, so it's. It's how you react to that, work hard in training and work on your weaknesses and I feel like I'm doing that at the moment. But um, yeah, massively from last season I feel like, especially this season, maybe the start of this season, I feel like I've improved massively. It's been said a lot over the last 12 months with, with certain managers elsewhere that some managers improve players, some managers don't. What's this manager been like for you? Yeah, I think, well, he's he's been my only manager really in professional football and especially when I joined Gateshead, I feel like... I've been able to play well under him. He's, he's put a lot of trust into me as I have him and he's played me in positions which has allowed me to express myself and come in here as well. He's, he gave me more opportunity and I'd like to think I've taken it. Uh, he's played me in a few positions. I feel like I'm quite versatile so I can do a job in many positions but he has allowed me to get forward and express myself which has paid off because I've got a few goals this season. What's the ambition then for the next 12 months now? Just try and kick on, um, whether that be with Port Vale or if I want to try and express myself at a high level. I think if, if you're not wanting to play higher, then you're probably not really testing yourself. So I think I'm going into every game now, just putting 100% in, seeing seeing what will happen from now until the end of the season. Well, it, it might not be with Port Vale at the moment because your contract is up. Just tell us where you're at with that at the moment. Yeah, um, it's, it's been mentioned a few times. Um, like I say, I'm, I'm happy here at Port Vale. I'm playing playing well under the gaffer. The fans have been really good to me here. I'm settled in the area. So if something was to come up in in the next few months about a contract, then I'll be happy to speak to them about it. And what you've just said must play a big part in that. The fact that you are settled, you know, you're living with, what, near some of the other players as well. That must make a big difference that you're happy and settled. Yeah, exactly. Look, I'm living with two lads similar age to myself. Um, it's, it's good to have your own freedom living away from home and especially like you said with, with two lads that I know really well um, the fans have been really good to me here uh, it's a nice area to live in like I said I've settled really well and how much are you looking forward to Macclesfield on Saturday because I know most people at Port Vale enjoyed the crew game this isn't the kind of localish fixture yeah I, well, that's why I, I heard that we're taking a few people there so it'll be a, another good atmosphere to play in um, we know that they've had a couple of good results recently with so Campbell coming in, he's, he's changed it a bit and they're, they're on a good run, but I'd like to think that we're, we're on a, not a bad run ourselves, we're, we're scoring goals, but we just need to work on a few things and hopefully we can do that in training and show again on Saturday.